Hey everybody, it's Spirit Tunes in the Tarot, and I'm your favorite Spirit DJ Bree, ready to finish off the rest of y'all's St. Patrick's Day. Yes, special since I was kind of gone for a little bit, but I'm glad to be back. Welcome back if you're returning, and welcome to if this is your first time. Welcome aboard. Yes. It's been interesting today, uh, you know, I, how manifesting works. It does work, folks. How I know is because I had blessings today, two of them, especially when it was due, you know. Um, money is not evil nor good. It just is. It's an energy. It's a tangible thing, but it has uh, no discrimination. Yes. The only thing that's discriminating is when people use it for the evil purposes. But other than that, good people can have money too. Yes. Hope everybody's doing good today. Okay. Tonight we're going to finish off with uh, Scorpio. Hello, Dacia Scorpio. Finishing off with Pisces. Yes, so y'all can go back and use it. Energy is fluid. When you're meant to be here, you are meant to be here. It is on your timeline. Any messages can come about. And Dacia, I mean, uh, hi, Dacia. And love with light, I uh, subscribe to your channel. Y'all go check her out. Give her a chance. And uh, she... Found her purpose was to give to others. I've been getting some messages today because I let things go and let my father handle it. It is really good. Yes. I love all you guys too, especially on my mods. I have some really faithful mods. Man, it's so muggy in here. My glasses are fogging up. <laughs> all right. We are using Green Day today. Play your cards. Play your lotto tickets. Okay, we have Glycerine Bush. It's Green Day Radio on Pandera for all you new ones. Um, I work with radio stations like uh, Sirius XM and things like that. Hopefully soon, again, it'll be YouTube music. Yes. Hello, Hedger. I hope you're old enough to be here, <laughs> you guys. If not, don't try to grow up too soon. It's too many responsibilities and not always fun. You think it is, but it isn't. It isn't. All right, we're going to start off with Scorpio. Welcome aboard. Get your get your pens and paper out. Your little journal. Yeah, the poor man's journal. Awesome. And uh, if you need to go back and refer to something or refund it, you know, rewind it, I'm saying, rewind it to get the message then that's okay all right we got somebody that's bringing in the food yes bring in the food anybody got the munchies out there <laughs> all right um it's 420 somewhere um yeah so yeah don't try to eat what you can't eat but it may be past present or future like i said energy is fluid what goes above 101 right now? 1036101. One. Check out those numbers. Maybe good numbers to gamble with. I'm not promoting that, just saying. Once in a while is okay. You never know. It's, all it takes is one ticket. Yes. Also, y'all go check out Mojo's Tarot. He's really good. He just hit a milestone. Nice. And also, uh, Tamsy Fay. And happy St. Patty's Day to you guys. You all are my friends. And, of course, check out Love with Light. All right, let's get started, Scorpio. We just finished with Libra. All right, so we got Glycerin by Bush. All right. One more time, Spirit. Pull a few cards. All right. I pulled out all the green cards today. We got loss. That was in the last one. Maybe you have something in your labor. People who spend the most time with shape who you are. Yes. So make sure you don't hang around with them stinky dogs. 
And you might have Libra in your chart. We got legal here. Okay, let's hope something's good in your favor. All right. I'm only reading oracle cards tonight. In the overall energy in part one, I did use the crystal tarot cards. They're also oracle. I'm using the money cards. I'm using the fallen angel, which works with your subconscious um, dark side. I have the kitchen witch, the herbary. We got lavender. Awesome. I'm hoping one of these we got a few more to go with that special herb. You know what I'm saying over here. Yeah. Please, yeah. See, somebody said they're not changing. They didn't want to change. See, somebody let their friends tell them what to do. Hello, Aunt She. Welcome back, baby. Really, dude? <laughs> Obviously, you don't because you're over here talking, right? Oh, jeez. I love the trolls, too. You know, they spend more time wasting it instead of doing something good. You know, I study every day, too. Funny, funny, funny. Alrighty. I'm good on she. How about you, baby? Happy St. Pieties Day. And to our to the Pisces. Regeneration. Tarragon. Alright. Glycerin. Alright, let's get y'all a green spell from the witch's tarot. Or witch's spells. Spell bug. There's all kinds of spells in here. If, if that's what you like to do. These are all positive, though. All right, what do we got for Scorpio? Love my Scorpios. Whatever you have in your chart, sun, rising, moon, Venus. I have it in my Venus. So they are considered the best lovers. Hey, what's up, moon goddess? Hey, dude, if you want to hang around, that's fine. What is it? Uh, talks or whatever it is. You know, it, we know you want attention because, you know, you're acting like you really need it. Otherwise, you could be doing something more productive, right? So why don't you hang around and learn to be a part of something good instead of trying to destroy stuff like that? It, it doesn't pay off. <laughs> it doesn't pay off, man. Not for you. I mean, it pays, but it ain't the right karma you want, man. All right, so we got Altar Spell, the Blessing Bowl, yes. All right, I need y'all Angel Card. Yeah. Get y'all some uh, marijuana metaphysical cards for my dreamers out here, the ones that are productive and like a better life instead of the people that are just have a snippy attitude and have no life that's why they're on here spamming trolling and trying to be destructive because that's all their mommy taught them how to do yes boo hoo <laughs> that's all right the school of hard knocks will teach you yes especially when it's turned on you all right so we got elegor 12 conflict oh beautiful beautiful angel all right Californication, red hot chili peppers. Ooh, somebody's in California Kating. <laughs> I'm so glad to be here tonight, and I'm glad y'all are with me sharing this journey. All right, guys, don't forget, y'all get a first class seat. Put your ears on, get tuned in, tapped in, because spirits in the house. Yes. Dreams of Californication. You don't have to sell your soul to have a happy life. He'll give it to you quick, but it may not be something that you like. Boy, I'm such a rapper, especially during Christmas time. I'm an OG. And I'm proud of who I am. It took me many years to get here and quite a few lifetimes. And I had a choice to come back here or not, and I chose to come back. Why? Because this ain't so bad. Just some people just think they're so creative. They, you know, maybe it's just their time to 
shine, but not anymore. It's changing. The polar shift is here, baby. It's the last shall be first, and the first shall be last. And, you know, our Father is using a lot of us for karma. Hey, hey, Seuss, baby. Thanks for coming back. We love you all the time, man. I'm thinking about getting me a, a beautiful picture drawn. I'm going to draw a picture. May do one myself. Maybe I'll do a, a cameo. But I'm still thinking about doing a tattoo. Yes, because I wear the blood of Jesus. <clears throat> Californication. All right, so we got initiation. Awesome. We were just talking about that, in a way. All right, we got sexuality. Ooh, Californication. So y'all are some lovers. I can't make this up. Choices, yes, alchemy. All right. Exclamation. Californication. What do we got? What herbaries do we got for our Scorpios? Yes. Yes, maybe you could teach me how to do something with yarn. My, you know, I was dumb. My, my mom died and I didn't have time to think and I gave away all of her, you know, needing needles and stuff like that. Man, I could kick myself for that. I just, you know, she tried to teach me when I was younger, but I wanted to do a quilt. I did kind of do a quilt with my mom, but it was a gift for somebody else. But that's okay. I have my talents. All right. All righty. So we got raspberry. All right. Create space. All right. Oh, soft porn. So somebody's got some addiction. They need to work on that, man. See where it's going to get you, man. I'm telling you. Well, that fornication. All right, let's get started. Scorpio, buckle up for the ride. All right. Green Witch Oracle, well, you got regeneration. Tarragon, it's 44 is a good number. Check that number out. Okay, we got it. All right, Tarragon, Regeneration 17. Artemisia Dracu Draculus. Gardening adds years to your life and life to your years. Yes. Anonymous. Oracle meanings. What to do next is something that needs focus under the influence of tarragon. It will often indicate what work needs to be done to align the physical with the spiritual. A gift could be coming your way soon and a relationship will step up a level. Nice. Look at what can be redone if given extra care to grow again or if bringing it back into your life will serve you in a positive way, Terracon also highlights plagiarism or taking inspiration without credit. Cultivation. Terracon is a perennial herb that can be sown in most climates in the spring after the danger of the last frost has passed up until early summer. It must be positioned in full sunlight and it will do well either in garden beds or deep containers with a richly fertile soil. Due to its ex extensive root system, this plant requires infrequent watering. Once established, if mulched well, harvest leaves are required. Magical correspondences. Uses, sensuality, confidence, courage, protection, sexuality. You guys are some lovers. I can't make this up. Just use protection, will you? You know, that could be could take you out all right use uh like i said deities Air, aries mars artemis celestial is mars astrological sign is aries so maybe you have some of that in your chart scorpio boy fire and water boy that's a mixture i'm hearing church bells swing swing the all-american rejects <laughs> <laughs> See, I'll take your rejects or you think somebody is. Regeneration spell. 
regenerate something you want to see grow again with the s with this essence so maybe if you get rid of that addiction or they get rid of, rid of that addiction maybe you'll think about it right put water in a clear bowl and place three fresh tarragon sprigs in the water one for the past one for the now and one for the future place the bowl in sunlight for an hour and then strain it into a spray bottle spritz on items and even people who need regeneration in, in, in areas to lift the energy of alignment and reconstruction. All right. I likes that. Let's see what Lavender's got for us. Sleep. Nice. I like to use Lavender all the time. Um, I also love YouTube Mom. Her favorite color was Lavender, and so is mine. It's a form of Amethyst. Color. All right. So somebody wants to carry on again. Here's that re regeneration song, Spirits in the House. All right. Regeneration. So somebody wants to regenerate a relationship, you or them. Worries or stress won't help you sleep, but a pinch of me will take you deep. Inhale my scent before you go to bed, then awake refreshed with a clear head. This magic is worked with harm to none, so mote it be there it is done. Lavender's guidance. As a responsible magical practitioner, it is better to light candles instead of burning them at both ends. Late nights, parties, and work or home commitments have taken their toll on you. Like I said, it could have taken a toll on them or you, and it may be hurting your relationship with this addiction. Just saying, allegedly. And the luggage under your eyes is proof of sleepless nights. Get some sleep, Scorpio. So do yourself a favor and get an early night. My scent is blessed with properties to relieve you of insomnia and to induce deep sleep. Even though sleep is important for your well-being, all, on all levels, you may need to call on me to lend you a helping hand in other ways. I have a soothing reputation as a natural aid to help you relax, unwind, and let go of stress. Place me under a pillow or dab a few drops of essential oils onto your temples before bed, and you will nod off in no time. Groggy mornings will soon be a thing of the past. As you awaken refreshed and vigorous sweet dreams, that's better than taking those tablets, you know, or melatonin or whatever it is taking too much so this will help you i also go with colors in my house in certain rooms to promote red and green is good in a kitchen um healing colors in the bathrooms the bedroom should never be a bright red unless you californication <laughs> Recommendation recipe, lavender pouch for combating insomnia, aiding sleep. Craft a sachet bag for purchase, an organza bag. Fill with dried lavender buds. Add a couple drops of pure lavender. If you'd like a stronger scent, tie or sew the top of the pouch. Pop it under your pillow or leave it on your nightstand to ensure a good night's sleep as you smell it. So, um, I use lavender in each. So that's good because you're you're it, it it goes with the um receptors. Lavender or lavandula grows worldwide and is harvested mainly to produce essential oil. Lavender aids relaxation, has antiseptic and anti inflammatory properties, and is often used as a natural mosquito repellent. It was introduced to England in the 1600s and was used for making jams and tea. Yes, lavender tea. So that will help you sleep. Also, I used to grow them in my garden. Yes. All right. Nice job, guys. All right. So we've got loss. Expect some financial turmoil in the near future. That doesn't mean that it's going to be total loss, but there is going to be a change. Okay. There is going to be a change. Ain't no rest for the wicked. <laughs> it is lavender. <laughs> Spirit. Ooh, I love it. Golly, confirmation right there. This is hilarious, man. I love it. He's got a sense of humor. A job loss could make it difficult to keep control of your money. You will have to work really hard. 
me. I think if you if you try to, to remember what I said in the beginning, that that well, if you're wicked, money don't grow on trees. That's a lack mindset. If you act like it's energy and you just you, you affirm or make your uh, affirmations and your manifesto that things are going to go go flow, all you got to do is write down what you need. I try to put down what I want, not what I need, because that's still a lack mindset, right? So the people you spend the most time with shape who you are. If you want to be rich, go hang around where the rich people hang out. Some of them hang out in bookstores you'd never know. Go hang out with people that you want to learn from. And believe me, people that have, have knowledge want to share it, right? But they're not going to share it with people that waste their breath, okay? All right, so legal. You might have to take care of some legal matters related to financial issues. Now, this doesn't have to be totally bad, guys. It just means that get, you know, do things in the right order, you know, get set up. There's there's companies out there. I may, uh, ch I'm going to check out this one company. And if they're really good, I will let you guys know. And I'll, I'll give them a shout out, you know. Could you could receive money from some kind of legal matter. So you may be winning something. Like I said, it doesn't have to be negative. This is a good time to handle any legal matters involving money. And I'll take that because I've got Scorpio in my chart. But I... So legal matters, Libra, right? All right. So create space, raspberries, page 60. There you go. Love library cards. I like to work with stuff like that and maybe i will make some stuff for you that will help y'all some like oils and things like that give me time and let me get going i'm going to be plan on being around for a little while so i want to teach you guys how to manifest and cope with things you know we didn't always learn how to do that with our families we just did what we were told right doesn't always mean it's right times change and we have to go with the flow all right and they did the best that they could. And I love them. Thank you so much for my ancestors. And the family members that I do have left. Some of them I had to walk away. Because it was not good. So it's hard for, for us to do that. But sometimes we have to. Raspberry is Rose's younger sister. Sweet and wild. But also steady handed. She loves the earth and its smallest creatures. So her... Ebulent branches twist and crawl, creating nests for birds and sanctuaries for snails. She'll rock wee babies and scurry about with toddlers. Mm, Y'all are good with kids and little animals. Rarely giving in to the gravitas that permeates most members of her family. <laughs> okay, I think I'm going to grab me some of this. Okay, <clears throat> this is funny. Laughter floats through her leaves as she flexes and twists. Sounds like a bike sheet to me, right? And I don't know if she's got the thorns to go with it. You too can be like this, she says, demonstrating pliability earned by drinking deeply of mineral-rich soil. Sit with her and she'll share with you the secret of weaving space and creating strong containers for the emptiness that new life needs in order to thrive. Thank you. When raspberry appears, look to how you are or aren't nurturing a space within. Yes, sorry about that. That's your insides. Your sub, you know, bringing your subconscious to the conscious because the subconscious was when we were when we were young kids couldn't talk, right? So we our subconscious creeps up sometime during our lifetime. It changes. So hello, feather. About time. Where you been? I miss you. Where's your recipes? I made chicken and Cajun rice tonight. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. And thank you, spirits, guides, ancestors, and the most high. And of course, the Lord for my blessings today. It is a good day. How about y'all? Yeah, you caught me. <laughs> I was sneaking around, feather. <laughs> Hi, Fiona. My lovely, lovely lovely moderators us man i tell you what they're die hard and very protective guys they are <laughs> they ain't gonna let nobody y'all don't have to do anything they will so y'all better be nice 
Okay, we can take some jokes around here because, you know, I got a strong mind. You know, if you can't take a, li a, a picking, you're going to get a licking. That's the way I grew up. They don't talk to you. Well, then we don't like you. That's it. We may not say much, but we'll show you that we love you. Because we believe in actions more than words. All right, so I like that. Man, I really do like the raspberries. All right, so the blessing bowl. I recommend doing this sanctuary spell at least once a year as it imbues your home with an aura of serenity and makes the blessings in your life tangible. Hello. So this is going to help you manifest, guys. Okay. Sit in a comfortable position with your absolute favorite essential oil scented candle lit and place it in a bowl in front of you. I like to use the wax scents, those warmers. I do, I do, I do. Think about the blessings and gifts in your life. So it means write down your gratitude list, even for things you didn't expect to have, what you did, and thank those as if you have them already. Breathing steady and deeply, inhaling and exalting slowly for five minutes. As you meditate, send the positive energy into your crystals and the flame of the candle. Now, the blessings are there in the bowl. Anytime you need them. There you go. See, I'd let that rhyme too. Nice. All right. So we got times like these. Uh, food fighters, like I said, look at that art up there. Yes. Times like these. Yes. All right. What oracle do we have? Choices. You are the alchemist. So start making better choices in your life, uh, Scorpio, for the best of your health and things like that. And your sexuality, just be safe, okay? And make sure you're not somebody or yourself. Just make sure you've got those childhood wounds that caused you to maybe have addictions or someone else. Maybe you can help them by talking to them. Initiation, yes, the hangman here. So you're going to be initiated after this change, hopefully. And let's see what the angel Eligor and number 12 conflict is got to say. All right. Times like these. It's time to change, man. Yes. All right. 12. Okay. Hi. Hey, Patrick. How's it going? Tonight, I'm uh, happy St. Patty's to you too, baby. I'm just reading this, the all signs for this day because I figured y'all were special and deserve something nice for y'all, all my dreamers. And this is our favorite day for sure. All right. This is one for us. So write your manifestos tonight. Take a little time out for you. You write your dreams, not somebody else. Okay, element fire and the planet Venus. Ha <laughs> ha, there you go. Maybe you got Saji in your chart. I'm claiming this one. Mess, except the sexual stuff. <laughs> I don't do that. Except with my honey. That's it. I got that under control. I did that for 15 years. I was celibate so I could get close to my Lord. All right, message. Aggression must sometimes be met with greater and more cunning aggression. Elagor is a warrior who can appear on a winged horseback bearing a lance, banner, and scepter. Yes, that is also... Sagitt like I said, Sagittarian energy, and it's also acclamations, victory card. War and an example of how leaders should inspire loyalty in their troops through courage and compassion. I am your leader. And through sharing their hardships. Yes, we do. He can also read the likely patterns of the future and adapt his plans accordingly. Yes, go with the flow. That's how you do it with the money, too. Just have faith and know that it's going to come through. <laughs> if you cannot rise to the occasion yourself, you must seek one who can. And I'm willing to help. Conflict. Yes. All right. There you go. There you go, Scorpio. Thanks for stopping by. If you want to stay and hang out a little longer, you're more than welcome. Because we love you. You may have some other in your chart. So go back and check the fire signs for additional messages.
Oh, I like those lemon drops. Oh, yes. Yes, I had an apple one not too long ago. Candy apple. Oh, it was good. Yeah, it was nice. I drink something like that every great once in a while to celebrate. But I don't like getting soused. I've had those days. Yeah. But I, I did was a connoisseur of wines and stuff like that for a long time. And then I had a full bar of people that came. All right. Thank you so much, Smooches. Thank you for stopping by, Scorpio. Hope to see you again. And thanks for all the likes and shares. We are growing. Yes, we are. All right, let's get going now for Saggies. We got any Saggies in the house? <laughs> I'm more of a Fucius, which is Scorpio and uh, Sagittarius. All right, what do we got for our beautiful, beautiful Scorpio dreamers out there? All right, we got It's Been a, a While by Stained. It's been a while, huh, Saggies? Yeah, it's been a while. I'm glad to be back. I hope you are, too. Welcome to the show, if you're new. Hope you become a dreamer like the rest of us. Uh, I work with the radio stations. Spirit Talks Through the Music. I am an and intuitive reader. So, I work with energies. I feel y'all's energy. Wow. Okay. And now, you only confirm. 4, 2, 1, 4, 4. We got 128. We, y'all, or a lot of y'all, are part of the 144. Yes. That happened during the 2020 uh, alignment of awakening through the portal. Some of them have closed during this Leo season and last. Those holes, they say, they closed up. How is that possible? Because they're portals. Yes, our spirits can, can go through. This has got a, a shield around it, the earth. All right, what do we got for our beautiful Sagittarius? Unstable, like a roller coaster. Manifesting. Oh, yeah. Yes. Control. Okay. Could say I'm never myself. See, he's saying I've been a while since I have, since I love myself. So we're working on it, right, Saggies? It's been a while. I'm with you. So somebody keeps you grounded, Saggies. Yes. We are listening to Green Day. Pick that just for y'all. Dandelion. So there's two more or another one. Oh, I think it's the first batch of dandelion. So you may have those in your chart. Okay. It's wishes. Make your wishes, baby. Yes. <laughs> There's two others. Dandelion, I believe, in the uh, herbary as well. I've been waiting to see <laughs> that special herb comes out in the recipe. <laughs> so y'all will get a bonus if it comes out tonight. I'll show y'all before I leave tonight if it doesn't come out. It's pretty cool. So I pulled y'all out a little bit of purple, green. I did some tarot and the overall message. Y'all might want to go back and listen to the first one. It has the intro in it. Been a while. All right. We got bananas. Duality. Ooh. So somebody's medical. Number 27. Sorry. All right. It's been a while since I've continued to. Yes. It's been a while. I can tell. Remember just the way you were faced. So somebody can remember what you taste like. Oh, 
Oh, yeah, there is. There's uh, parallel universes just like this. <clears throat> but there also, if you, uh, there's one of them I did during a solar eclipse. I we had Virgo and then Sagittarius. Uh, it, it's a whole, you know, it's a super one. The Sagittarian was. And there, I've been studying a little bit about that, that it looks like a black hole, but it's, it's, it's kind of like reversed. It's weird. Yes. So we got Sagittarius. We got our own time portal. Yes. All right. We got Inner Sanctum. Sweet Violet. Oh, oh yeah. All right. Dun -dun 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 I'm having tribal. Trying to sleep. Brain stew. Green day. Ha <laughs> ha. Somebody go eat some chocolate. That'll help. Yes. All right. We got that going on. For our lovely sedges. Still I try. So you've been working overtime with that brain of yours. 133. 3133. 2146. Alright, what do we got for our Sagittarius spirit? My eyes feel like they're gonna bleed. So you working overtime using your eyes, can't sleep. All right. What do we got, Sagis? Somebody's been doing a little 420. Got <laughs> cotton mouth. He says my mouth is dry. Something's burned out in my room. Guidance. All right. We got the union. Oh, baby's going to be getting some union here. And the stability. So we got unstable and instability. So there's a message in that for sure. My mind's set in overdrive, man. Y'all are some manifesting, manifesting dreamers. Yes. Going to get y'all a spell going here to help you manifest. My senses are dull. Smoke some 420 then. That'll help you get really creative. Just remember to write it down because you might not remember when you wake up how you did it. <laughs> you accomplished it. Oh. All right, what do we got for Sagis? How you been, Feather and Fiona? All righty, what do we got? We only need one spell, Spirit. Okay, healing spells, yeah. Wednesday Wisdom, all right, is the name of the spell. All right, so the light went out of your room. I like it in the dark. Yes, I do. My eyes are really sensitive. Good, I'm glad you're okay. I missed you. Just thought you disappeared on me. Haven't seen Joey in a while either. He's probably off getting his new business going, I hope. All right, what do we got for Sedgies? Glad y'all are here tonight, man. All right, what do we got, angels, for Sagis? I need to get these mosquitoes. The mosquitoes out here. They like me. Batin 10, travel. All right, so number 10, y'all going to be traveling. I think I got them all. All right, let's get started. Don't forget, get your pen and paper, and glad you're here, Sagis. Get your seat and get your ears on and concentrate. Leave, leave the noise out so you can enjoy the show. And you won't be disturbing anybody else. All right. So let's start with the bananas. Who's going bananas over here? We got du duality. All right. Musa Akuminata means banana. All right. Go get your health checked. Just saying. Stay healthy because we need you around, Sagis. Y'all are the keepers of the law. Y'all uphold the law. 
Y'all are creative. You set your sight on something. Y'all are good bounty hunters. You name it. The zombies, the cranberries, all right. Maybe they're dried cranberries. <laughs> zombies. So y'all are putting up with some sleeping people out there that are not awake. So the best thing to do is wake them up, right? Any way we can. All right. Bananas. Here we go. The color yellow also is good for healing. Why does it say carrots here? Jeez. Sorry about that. There it is. On page 66 is a number. Uh, I was just looking at the other one. That's what messed me up. Okay. As human. 27 duality banana. Gardening is civil and social, but it wants the vigor and freedom of the forest and the outlaw. <laughs> I can't make this up. <laughs> the bounty hunter. God, shoot. The spirit. <laughs> Let's take it. <laughs> Oracle meaning. It's not me. It's not my fantasy. They're not my family. Head in your head. Your head. They are crooked today. Oh, wow. Your hair come homes and their hair bombs and their guns in your head. So somebody's fighting in your head, right? Oracle meanings. It is time to look at the shadow and the light in the conjunction with each other. Each is as strong as the other, and both have positive qualities and learning points for you. Wow, we were just talking about the black hole, the dark and the light, right? The answer to any question is maybe, and perhaps moving away a little will allow a better view as bananas ask. That you stand back and look at the horizon. Do not give in to any situation that doesn't align with you at present. Same thing. When you fly in a plane, you go by the horizon line. Cultivation. Considered to be a per perennial herb as they don't form a woody stem as a tree does. Bananas are grown taken from other banana plants. They grow. I mean, they'll multiply. They also bring rats because it just does. And, of course, flying monkeys. <laughs> Plant these at any time in tropical, subtropical and temperate areas that do not drop below 15 degrees Celsius. They need a very fertile, well-drained, though moist soil, and a position that enjoys full sun, but it but is sheltered from winds. Harvest entire bunches of bananas around a month after individual fingers cease growing and are well-rounded. Magical correspondences, uses, potency, prosperity, fertility, marriage, ambition. There you go. Deities, Venus, uh, Canola, uh, Lax, Lakshmi, Celestial, Venus, astrological sign is Cancer. There you go. It's your water sign, Cancer, if you have that in your chart as well. The duality spell. Perform this art project to explore the shadow and the light. Peel a banana and eat it while focusing on the challenge or situation you would like to explore. Take photos of the inside of one of the banana peels and then ink it with an ink pad. Press it into heavy white paper. No differences between the two images looking for and interpreting any pattern and symbols. Wow. Hey, Pam Bear, what's up? Happy th uh, Happy Thanksgiving. Yeah, I am grateful today. Maybe you are too. Um, the gratitude is a key. Um, happy St. Patty's Day. And I hope y'all do a manifest today. This is y'all's day for the year. Okay? It's your best day. All right, so we're looking at unstable. Life is like a roller coaster with you, constant change. There have been a lot of ups and downs with your finances, money coming in fast and going out just as quickly. Yes, because it's flowing. Be responsible, you know, get what you need and save for that rainy day. Four, four, one, five, three, one, four, one, guys. Fast changes regarding money or unexpected turn of finances. Yes. 
Always, always. Manifesting, you guys. Jupiter, at least for another seven years, seven and a half years, you got it going on. This year, follow through. Make, work hard. Next year is the harvest season. Your bananas are coming. <laughs> the offspring. Gotta get away. <laughs> yeah, get away on a vacation. All right, manifesting. You have all the tools you need to increase your income. Good fortune is coming soon, I told you. An opportunity may come to you where you can showcase your talents. All right, I can't wait for that. All right, so let's see what the sweet violets got to say. Oh, well, we got one more control here. All right, try to be a little more flexible and allow the universe to work its magic because we know you guys can be bosses. So just remember... We still need people and they need us. So be kind to others. Give where you can. Doesn't it necessarily mean money? Don't lose out on opportunities because it didn't come in the form you wanted it to. In other words, don't dictate how it's going to be, how it's going to come. Just put it your order in to Burger King. I'm just kidding. Sometimes blessings come in disguise. Stay open-minded to see the potential. Yes. So when you're manifesting, listen to your guides, when and where to move, use your compass, and wait for the signs. We don't make opportunities. That's what we're against because people are forcing or taking instead of being created themselves. So, like I said, we put it out there and we wait for our signs, and when we see the opportunity come, we take it. Now, we can be risk takers and create things, yes. We didn't get the light bulb until 156,000 times later. All right, stability. Yes, you are the emperor, empress, and that's what you stand for, stability. That's why you have four legs, right? And union. All righty, y'all going to be coming into union of partners with somebody or they want to with you, Sagis. And use your guidance. Like I said, you know how to step it, baby. You know how to step it. All right. All right. So let's see what your spell is for today. Wednesday could be Wednesday. Wisdom. For abundant blessings or spiritual enlightenment, burn a white candle anointed with lavender oil. There we go. That's lavender again. <clears throat> that was in the last one, I believe. That's sweet violet. Okay. All right. Could be for the last one we had uh, with Scorpio that had lavender. All right. Nice. So you may have that in your chart. You do have cancer. Here. Okay. Candle anointed with lavender oil on your altar during a waning moon, which is, I believe, a crescent moon. On Woden's Day, which is Wednesday, place a single white rose in water and lay a bundle of dried white sage beside the rose incense. Light the incense, then take the sage bundle, light the end, and pass the smoke over your altar to smudge the space. Chant, may grace be bestowed upon the spirit, thy spirit, and so it is by magic sealed. Well, you know, you might burn some of that good that good green sage, too, for the ancestors. <laughs> All right, let's see what we got here. We got, you might have Gemini in your chart, too, as well, with the duality. Dandelion, the wishes. Let's see what the wishes is. All that good stuff, I can tell you that. Yes. We, we got, see... Feather showed up just in time because we got all these stuff going on here. You might check it out. Feather, if you haven't been around in a while, <clears throat> all the spices and the fruits and the veggies in here just for you. Some good recipes. All right. So we got 44 again. Well, we got a lot of uh, building here. Foundations, nice. Y'all are doing it. I'm proud of you. All right. Make your wishes, people. When you wish upon a star, my seeds of dreams will take you far. Upon the air, now blow a gust and focus on belief and trust. The magic is worked with harm to none, so mote it be, there it is done. We got Santa Monica 
Everclear. Ooh, somebody's drinking some Everclear. <laughs> All right, so somebody's traveling. I like it. Yeah. Downtown. All right, Dandelion's Guidance. All your wishes are still floating around in the ether and won't come true until the moment you believe they will. For it is belief that is the key ingredient when it comes to making magic. Your obsession for possession has blinded you to unseen factors that are blocking the attainment of your goals. You must be clear about what you wish for. And believe me when I say that everything is possible, even the impossible, when it comes to making magic. A little focus is required, as well as belief. When my bright yellow flowers turn a mystical white, make your desires known into my seed head. Blow on me gently to release your wishes and watch me float freely with the sylphs of the air I, as I work in conjunction with the fairies to magically manifest your wishes into fruition. I remember when I was a kid, we used to see those, you know, I used to think they was a weed, you know, and then blow those. Those was really cool. All right. Recommended recipe, dandelion coffee for use as a laxative, increasing urine output. There you go, guys, if you're having trouble. Uh, take 15 to 17 dandelion roots and place in an oven for about 30 minutes. At 200 degrees and brown. You can keep them in a bag, by the way. Now, boil roasted roots for 15 minutes in filtered spring water. Strain through a fine mesh strainer. You can add spice of your choice, such as cinnamon. You also you can also add a little milk and honey. Dandelion re recorded use for medicinal purposes of the dandelion dates back to the ancient Egyptians, Greeks, and Romans and also to the Anglo-Saxons and Normans of France. The dandelion is thought to have evolved over 30 million years ago. Its name means tooth of the lion. It is not a weed, but rather an ancient healing herbal licious plant. All right. All right, let's see what we got for the inner sanctum. All right, sweet, but sweet violet, page 28. Nice to see you, Saggies. Watch the world die. All right, here we go. Inner Sanctum, Sweet Violet. Sweet, sweet violet sings of sun and springtime, carpeting meadows and lawns with lush purple petals. But its glorious show is mere flirtation. Her true abundance comes in autumn when, quietly and with little fanfare, she shares her seed with the earth, setting the stage for next spring's performance. Ballad has no trouble separating public from private. She knows both have their place and season. She's the gossip column socialite who quietly works in a soup kitchen on Wednesdays knowing life's most important work isn't always done in the public eye yes i do stuff behind it. and here we go wednesday twice so wednesday is y'all's lucky day saggies and this is your card and your flower nice i love the way this just connects it's awesome man thank you spirit you're awesome man All right, so we got Wanting, Green Day. Yeah, there you go. That's your song, baby. Wanting, yes, not needing, wanting. I want my needs met. Hello, not needs. I need, I need, I need. Then you need always needy. And it never comes. So I want my needs met. See how that goes? Believe me, it's taken a lot of practice in all the years, and I still screw up, so... I get it. So I can remind you. Okay, so somebody's going to be traveling. Um, Batin is the angel. Alrighty. This is your song, said you. Alright, create your, create your story, baby. Your life, it's yours. 
We ain't got that long. It can go as a flash. I don't. I, I would like to come back again. See people say, what? After what you've been through? Well, it's because I've been here many times. That's why. Okay. I wanted to come back because I like helping people. I got a hair coming in through my eyes here. Give me a second. Okay. Okay. Live without warning. <laughs> Take it at risk, baby. All right. So you got element earth. Planet of Venus. Here we go. We got a lot of Venus. Maybe you got Scorpio on your chart. Uh, I think Venus is also uh, Virgo or Empress. Message indicates a journey, either physical or spiritual. Guard your health. So take care of yourself. Your legs are and feet and lower parts are always in danger. So take care of them. Bathine is a beautiful angel who often appears carrying a serpent. This warns that she is not as gentle as she may at first seem, but it is also the snake of es Esculapius, the healer, which is the, the caduceus. Batine understands the virtues of herbs and crystals and is great healer and soother of troubled souls. She is also... A helpful guide for journeys, whether physical travels in the everyday world or spiritual adventures of the soul. There is a hint of danger in this card, but only if you are too complacent. So don't get complacent. It is also the card motto is travel, and that's what you are. That's your card. Man, this is just falling into place. I love it. Thank you for the confirmation, spirit, as usual. All right, closing time. Semi-Sonic. All right, we're closing out. Yes. Thank you so much. Sagittarius, I love you, babies. Closing time. Uh, so that's y'all's song, Closing Out. Well, believe it or not, I'm lactose intolerant. So, but I love my cheese. No, nicotine really thins your blood because it doesn't uh, it doesn't allow the you know doesn't allow for the oxygen to get to you. So somebody's going through closing time and having a good time tonight, or in your business, but you can't stay here. All right, thank you so much, Sagittarius. I hope you enjoyed the ride and your angels and your family's destination. Your me like I said, your messages. We love you. Smooches. See you next time and have a great manifesting today. All right. We are going to Capricorn. Welcome aboard Capricorns. But if y'all want to stay, Sagis are more than welcome because we love you. Um, so you're going to be traveling. All right. Welcome aboard newcomers. And old-time writers, welcome back. Hope things have been great. It's good to see y'all. All right, so moving to the exits. <laughs> I hope y'all found a friend, yes. All right. Um, yeah, I like to drink some water with mine, too. I'm drinking tea right now. Tea seems to quench my thirst. I like the Texas peach tree. Peach tea. I had some peach trees. All right. So welcome aboard again. Capricorns. How's it going? Put your feet up. Get your first class seat. Yes. Join us all on your journey to the bright side of the moon. Your journey today. Yes. We love you. Get your pen and paper, and don't forget, we work with the frequencies of the music, the angels, the lyricists, yes, the geniuses. All right, what do we got for Capricorns? <clears throat> what do we got for Capricorns? Spirit, our little devil horns, yeah. Our sin masters, yeah. Yes. Our creative business people. Yes, our earth, earthly. The best oil is krill oil. 
Yes, it's only in cold water fish. Cloves, okay. We had cloves earlier. I think it was the first first part one. Not sure, but cloves is good. It, I think it is. It's uh, Yes, that's in the beginning. Painkiller for the teeth. Nothing else will touch it. I know for a fact. Yes, believe it or not, I was stuck, could get out. So I learned how to use spices, fruits, everything. Yes, it's amazing. And it's all natural. It doesn't have all the stuff in it. We don't know what's in it. You know, and we can trust it. It may come to that point, folks. Just saying. All right, what do we got for Capricorns? What do we got for Capricorns? Capricorns. Back in the day, you know, people like us made that stuff. Yes, for doctors, you name it. Sing time. Root new beginning. Comes from some other beginnings in. Constant change, scorpionic energy, transformation, change. All right, what do we got for the cappies? Oh, well, there you go. It must be an Ophiuchus. All right, because we just had Inner Sanctum in the last one. All right. I get it. Maybe I should add an Ophiuchus tomorrow. Yeah, I might do that. People need to learn about Ophiuchus. It is from the planet Orion. You are a star, star seed from the planet Orion. That movie, Men in Black, is your movie. All right, we got Are You Gonna Be My Girl by Jet. Somebody wants you to fly on a jet. Nice. All right, Cappies. So you're going to be having your own plane, huh? Yeah. I got one. It's called Spirit Airlines. <laughs> they got all kinds of stuff, man. Now, yep. They got moving companies. They got everything. Somebody thinks you're fine and really wants to make you mine. You or them. Don't forget, don't take what you can't swallow. Leave it for somebody else. Don't be greedy. Put it back on the shelf. <laughs> I'm got it going on today. Money manager, yeah. All right, somebody got some money coming in. Yo, business people, yeah. You cappies, cappies, cappies. Goals. Yeah, transporter, yes. Yeah. All right. All right. All right, what do we got for Cappies, Spirit? Cappies. Cappies. Somebody wants to know, are you going to be their girl? Or guy. Take it, flip it how you want to. All right, I'm going to keep that one. Somebody thinks you're fine and really wants to make you mine. Yeah. Protection. There was one of the other ones. I can't remember it had protection in it. I'm trying to think. Was it cancer? All right. All right. What do we got? Give me some more. All right. We got aura. The truth. Yes. Big and balance. You're the wizard. All right. Let me make sure what I got. All right. I hope we got that one already. We need the angel and a spell card. And a witch, witch's garden, green witch garden. All right. Yeah, I use vitamin E, vitamin D, B12. All right, hold up a second. Oh, if I can get this done. Uh oh, I oh, hope I can get this done. Hope I can get this done before I run out. Ugh, I can't keep this charged today. I'm always working on it. Yes. What do we got for the cappies? Y'all don't forget to go check out Tamsy Pay and Mojo Tarot. 
the good peeps, man. And Love With Light. Yes, she's got a new one. Bodas. Nine Justice. You might have Libra in your chart. Yes. Yes. <clears throat> All right. I'm smart enough to be a PA. I work with my doctors all the time because I didn't want to take a lot of junk, you know. It's got a lot of side effects. And I'm really sensitive. But it's just gotten ever since I passed away in 2019, I've gotten really, really sensitive. Yes. Yes. I just got this phone, baby. It's new. <laughs> I just... I'm just using it a lot, okay? I do. I do. Plus, you know, I I, <laughs> I break, used to break stones. My energy was so strong. I could even break a diamond with my energy. It was crazy. Um, it's just the way it is. I'm on them all day. I used to run two or three. It was hard to keep the energy going in them. <laughs> I might need a new charger, maybe. Um, I'll wear them out. Uh-oh, somebody was in the hospital. Somebody thought she was crazy. Flagpole sitter, Harvey Danger. I'm not safe, but I'm not. Where have all the merry makers gone? <laughs> somebody feels all alone. So poor baby. <laughs> it's ironic. Here we go. Uh, well, see, I've got to have a longer card. I've got them. I use them usually at night. I've got one of those ones where you sit it on the magnet. It's like a magnet. I was using it before I got on because it, it does quicker, but it got really hot. So, love spells. Merry meat attraction ritual. All right. Let's see if I got them all. Yeah, I do. All right. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. We forgot one. These. Yeah. Yeah, I've got I've got a 13, so. <clears throat> Everybody's paranoid. Somebody's paranoid coming to get you. I wonder who it is. I don't think it's my collective here. All right. Somebody hears voices in their head. Oh, shoot. You know, it just might be that you can hear exceptional hearing. All right, so we got attraction. Pansy. Who had the pansy in the last one? I think it was two back. All right. All right. Let's get started, Capricorn. I hope you got your seat belt on because we're ready for this ride on the Soul Train. Yeah, the Dream Weaver Train. Some good energy, man. That forceful energy. Upbeat vibes. It's good. Nice to know you work in the phone business. I had my daughter-in-law used to work work in it. I got an iPad Air, I think. I need to take it back tomorrow sometime because, you know, ever since I got it, they were supposed to work on it. And at and had that uh, grid thing, and they was having a lot of issues. So they at least gave us a discount on it because we couldn't use it. And uh, I need to take that back and get them to get me at least a bigger um because i stepped on my tablet i mean my ipad my other ipad so they're gonna have to give me a one terabyte <laughs> i know i gotta post it sometimes if it's it, it some of them will go quick some of them it takes a minute pretty busy today i will get them up tonight for you guys 
All right, as soon as I get off of here, I got to do some, some things on it, and they got to check it. Oh, I know, I love Samsung. I love Samsung. But the last ones I had uh, was so strong, I don't know what's in them, what crystals or chips or whatever, but they, they frazzled. The screen went dead. I mean, just all blank. I, now, uh, TVs and stuff like that's good, but the tablets, you know what I'm saying? All right, so we got Waiting by Green Day. Okay, we're getting back to it. <laughs> All right, so what do we got here for my lovely Cappies? So you're closer than you've ever been. No, nah, it's all right. I, I could use a little break. All right, so Attraction. Pansy. All right, where's it at? Where's it at? Traction. All right, 82. 82, 10, completion. Something's on the tip of your tongue. Hello, Christian. How you doing? Put your translator on, baby. We want to hear what you got to say. Welcome. Hello, Daniela. Hi, baby. How you doing? All right. So we got 34 Attraction Pansy. In Gardens, beauty is a byproduct. The main business is sex and death. <laughs> oh, my goodness. That's Cappy's. That's your card, baby. You may have some in your, uh, some, the other signs in your chart. All right, pansies indicate that people are being pulled into your life who align well with you. Romance be, may be on the agenda, but this energy also helps build community and friendship circles. Yes, that's what Capricorn is, man. Right there. Love it. All right. Possibly where learning takes place, it is time to step back a little and happening naturally hesitation and overthinking could cause blockages and watch out for personal deception and gossip okay you know that that little devil thing could do yes that's part of it cultivation plant from the end of summer through to the end of autumn <clears throat> in tropics in autumn or spring in cold places and in temperate environments you can plant from early summer until the end of autumn the best position in which they receive full morning sun and afternoon shade. Feed every second week and deadhead regularly. The plants will flower in about 16 weeks, and the base life is around seven days. If you put a little aspirin in and cut them on an angle, you about two inches after the first cut, it will last a little longer. Uses, magical correspondence, memory, meditation, kindness, resonance, weather, magic. Yeah, you can run the weather too, huh? Deities, fairies, cherries, kunyin, celestial Saturn, astrological sign Libra. So they check out that Libra. And I think it's also in there. Attraction spell. Create a beautiful flower at Mandela to attract love and new good people. Gather an image of what it is you desire. And as many fresh pansies and do, and other flowers you can find, create a beautiful Mandela pattern using the flowers or surrounding your leave until it blows or weathers away, at which time you should attract what you desire. So it gives you a long time to manifesting power. So we got in, uh, in bloom, Nirvana. <laughs> flowers. Oh, my goodness. I love how spirit talks to us. It's great. Don't know what it means. Don't know what it means. All right. We got closed. Thirty-eight. Some lots of shooting stars. Yes, you are. They don't know what it means. People aren't. They don't know. Clothes, gossip, idle chit-chat, dish the dirt, 
untrue rumors spread and heard. Burn me in order to prevent gossip, slander, and detriment. This magic is worked with harm to none, so mote it be. There it is done. Yeah, guys, don't worry about the gossip. That's only haters going, so I don't feel you guys are doing it. But if you are, don't do that because it does come back on you. Close guidance. Whispers behind your back or a hushed silence when you enter a room indicates that you are the topic of conversation. Yes, you are. My business people, yes. While there's no harm in having a good old chin, chin wag with friends, bad mouthing someone's private business should be avoided. So hopefully nobody's doing that because they can get in trouble for that if you decide to. <clears throat> You're no stranger to juicy gossip yourself. Ha ha ha. He said this and she said that. <coughs> If you expect it, you must give it. It's just tittle-tattle. My antibacterial properties are powerful enough to wash any gossip monger's mouth out. Ooh. Be watchful of who you share intimate details with and play your cards close to your chest at this time. Yeah, tell them something half truth and half thought and see if it gets back to you. Don't tell it to nobody else. You'll know. Test, test your spirits, people. It's vital to keep your reputation in high regard, and so I will assist you in purifying, raising your vibration, and protect you from any smear campaigns. Burn me with a red candle to put a stop to any gossip that is affecting you now, or to prevent and protect you from slander in the future. No, it's gonna have to protect. They're gonna have to protect protect themselves from that. Mouthwash for toothaches. Mouthwash pain relief. I said this earlier. It's really good. Bring one cup of spring or filtered water to the boil the saucepan and add a handful of cloves. And if you wish, one teaspoon of ground cinnamon and fresh mint leaves. After 10 minutes, remove from heat, strain the mixture, and pour into a spray bottle. Spray liberally into mouth when needed. Cloves reveal. The ancient Chinese used cloves to sweeten their breath before an audience with the emperor. The clove was one of the first spices to be traded from the maluku islands a native tradition from these islands was to plant a clove tree for every newborn child so that the life of the child was the tree wow maybe you're gonna have a kid soon nice blessings to you all right that was nice all right let's see what the sweetie violet's got to say again that was in the last reading, I believe. Sweetie Violet. Sweetie Violet. Oh, page 28. Y'all enjoying the show? Hi, EM. What's up, baby? Me backwards, yes. <laughs> All right, we got... Nickelback, rock star. Yes, you are, baby. I said it earlier. We got a lot of stars today. Sweet to Violet. So don't get too crazy now, Capric Capricorn. You got to remember, think logically. Just don't go crazy when this, this comes to you. All right. Black Black it. Gonna join the My High Club at 30,000 feet. We had Jet on earlier. <laughs> that was Sagittarius reading, by the way. Sweet, sweet violet sings of sun in springtime, carpeting meadows and lawns with lush purple petals. But this glorious show is mere flirtation. Ooh, you love her. Her true abundance comes in autumn wind, quietly and with little fanfare she shares her seeds with the earth setting the stage for next spring's performance there we go your performance violet has no trouble separating public from private so that's good you'll be able to do that i love it the movie stars do that you know that's good keep your privacy like it says don't worry about the gossip because you're going to be a star that's what i'm feeling or you're going to be linked to a star yes i'm on capricorn 
Okay, she knows both have their place and season. She's the gossip column socialite. Oh, you're going to be, wow. Uh, the paparazzi. Who quickly work in a soup kitchen on Wednesdays. He went with the Wednesdays again, man. Knowing life's most important work isn't always done in the public eye. Yes, that's right. Because y'all have good autonomy, autonomy. And, you know, y'all are humble. You come from humble belongings. You help others. You're not just greedy, right? Fame and I took my hair and changed my name. Just want to be big rock stars. Well, just change cars. <laughs> Just come to eat. I take Sandy because we just won't eat. <laughs> Out in the family bars. The family stars. Okay, so money manager. This card could indicate your career or finances could take a giant leap forward. I love this song. Consider careers in money management, banking, accounting, or anything in finance. You can expect a happy outcome when it comes to your finances. Yes, if you're going to be a star. Transporter. This card. I want to be a, buck, be a rock star. This card is a good indicator that things will start moving for you rather quickly. Sounds like you might even be, I might be talking to a star or upcoming singer or something like that. Nice. A career in transporting such as travel, driving, or shipping could appeal to you. You big rock stars. Hilltop castles. Do you really need 15 cars? <laughs> Cindy, because we just won't eat. Stay away from that bad stuff, you Capricorns. A career in transportation such as travel, driving, or shipping could appeal to you. You could travel for work, or perhaps you need to take action on a financial metal. Nice. So you're going to be traveling too. All right. Maybe you're on Spirit Airlines. <laughs> Goals. Don't let the world lead you. Take the steering wheel and take control of your life. This would be a good time to write down your goals and aspirations. Yes, as I always say, focus on creating a manage and managing a budget. You may need a manager. Hey, I want to be a rock star. <laughs> yeah. I think, I know Capricorn, it sings really good. All right, protection. Yes, you're going to need that. You might need bodyguards. <laughs> and aura, you because you got a great aura. And yes, balance, because you are the wizard. Oh, my goodness. Thanks for the memories. Fall out a boy. Look at that sheep. Nice. Fall out, boy. Yes, look at that. All right. All right, your spell for today. All right, Merry Meat Attraction Ritual. Try this surefire attraction spell. Take a man-shaped mandrake root, commonly available at herbalist and metaphysical shops, or any statue, photograph, or figure of a man or woman. Place it on your altar and surround it with red and pink rose petals and candles. Place two goblets of red wine beside the arrangement and burn candles starting on Friday. Venus Day. Sip from one of the goblets and recite. Merry stranger, friend of my heart. Merry may we meet again. Hail fair fellow, friend well met. I share this wine and toast you. As we merry meet and merry part and merry meet again. Oh, that's sweet. I like that. Hello. Bota, Botus 9 Justice. You may have Libra in your chart. All right. What do we got for this fallen angel? All right. 115, people. All right. Thanks for the memories. All right. And thank you, Capricorn. We're coming to your destination. All right. You're welcome to stay if you like. If not, we'll see you next time on this train ride. Bodice, element, earth, planet, Mars. That's you. Message, short-term pain leads to a lasting and just settlement. Bodhis can appear in dreams and visions as a monstrous and terrifying serpent. 
In human guise, it seems a pale, long-haired warrior with two horns on his forehead and pointed teeth. <laughs> God, this is your card. I can't believe it. Wow. He bears a sharp sword with which he administers justice, cutting through confusion to reveal the root cause of disputes. He gives the courage to make difficult choices, and even though the right ones may seem harsh in the short term, they lead to peace and reconciliation in the end. Card motto, justice. There you go. You might have, might have Libra in your chart, but... Thank you for the memories as well, Capricorn, as the song says. And I appreciate you being here, and thanks for joining us on the journey tonight on the train. And thanks for liking and sharing the video. Till next time, switches, sweet dreams, baby. All right, we are now pulling up for Aquarius, y'all. Come on aboard and enjoy the ride with your fellow dreamers out here yes i'm gonna take a little break for a second and then we'll get on y'all's let the energy change a little bit get some more folks in the room how is everybody yes all right i hope everybody's staying blessed and healthy this day all right, somebody's going to be traveling, going on vacation. Man, I love it. Hey, call me a, a Capricorn. I'll go with you, man. <laughs> All right. All right, our stars are up next. And the healers. Trying to get this done before midnight. <coughs> We're almost done because I want to do this today. This is my goal today was to do this for you guys, man. And thank you to my moderators, man. Y'all are awesome. y'all keep hanging out and sticking with me we'll get some other things going see if y'all get y'all some perks We are listening to Green Day on Pandora. To all the newcomers or ones new to the room today, y'all check it out. Um, yes, decided to get a uh, Green Day station tonight. Good evening. You haven't seen me in a couple of weeks. Well, how come? <laughs> Well, I'm glad you're back. One, one, one in the house. Make you wish. What are you thinking? Take a snapshot. All right, let's get started. Aquarius, welcome aboard. Get your pen and paper out. Get your ears on. Get tuned in, tapped on. Spirit is in the house. Y'all are going to paradise. What do we got for Aquarius? My stars. My healers. Don't eat what you can't swallow. Save it for the next person. Share around here. Yeah. If you've got any kind of goals and things like that that y'all want to share with us, that's good. I love it. Thanks for liking and sharing and showing up. Yes. My dream team. The Dream Squad. All right. Toon Squad. What do we got for the Aquarius? Toon Squad. Thank you for the clear and concise messages from ancestors, guides, and definitely the Most High, and the Lord is with us. Today, I had gifts. Thank you again. Jesus is King. What is the purpose of life? Well, how I feel about, how I feel about that is we're here to just learn and love 
and prosper, like it says, right? But when you're reading the Bible, you got to ask for his understanding, not ours. Or reading anything for that matter. All right. Because we have all the answers within us. Yes. Be honest, stop feeling blah, blah. Turn the music on, baby. Get to feeling better. It may not be you. It may be somebody else. Maybe you need a little vitamin C, a little vitamin D. You'd be all right, baby. Yes. What do we got? Science. Yes. Aquarius. And we got Explorer. Wow. Nice. Money Manager. We got that again. Yes. You're not alone, baby. You might be a little lonely, but you're never alone. Your family's with you. Snow. Hey. Oh. Red hot chili peppers. Maybe you need to eat some spicy food. Yes. He's saying, Spirit's saying, listen to what I say. I got your hey yo. Listen to what I say. Spirit's talking. What do we got for Aquarius? Okay, so we got the we are one. All right, yes. Quaking Aspen. Look at that. It's a beautiful card, man. Beautiful freaking cards. Hey, yo. It's okay, Pam Bear. We can't expect you to be everywhere. We just love you being here for us. It's okay, baby. 442 in the house. 110. One seven one. Look up those numbers. It's okay, Pam Bear. It's all right, baby. Y'all can't always be here. It's cool, okay? Y'all are just part of the family from the get go. You know, my first hundred I got outside of YouTube. That was the first. And then I got a few. So it's okay. We are right, baby. It's an easy night. Other nights when we ask, when we answer questions, those are kind of crazy. So tonight, it's okay. So purity, white snow. What do we got, Aquarius? We love you, Pam Bear. You're doing a great job, baby. And we need you, so, but don't stress. It's okay. All of you guys, remember that. Truth, aura. You got a beautiful aura, Aquarius. Oh, yeah, protection. Yes. There's a lot of channels he said it's broken down. Okay, so we got memory. All right, somebody's thinking of you. It's been a little weird, but I wasn't expecting the blessings I got today. But, you know, uh, I'm also praying that my... Uh, man, we've had a lot of weird things going on. My, my son's wife got, in, got hit by a U.S. Postal Service. <laughs> She's okay. You know, they've had it a little rough lately. And he is a Capricorn. She is a Sagittarius. But I do love them so much. I really do. And I want my kids to prosper and them to have a good life. I want them to be, for me to rise and them to be my legacy at my feet. Yes. We all do that when we have kids. Alrighty. What do we got for Aquarius? Snow white as snow. What do we got? Let's go with it. Go. All right. What do we got? Spirit for Aquarius. Thank you. Where to go? We don't ever dictate to spirit how they're going to bring it to us because they have to set up alignment we don't see that part okay we just have our contracts all right that we signed up for we just because of the the denseness and the heaviness of this earth and the 
sphere that's over it. We don't always remember why until we wake up, okay? Oh, blackberries, invasive, okay. Already beneath the cover. That goes with this song. Light is the Where to go? Four seven four one one zero. Constant tonight. Yes, eleven master number, and zero is starting from scratch. Yes. What do we got, spirit? I love you guys. I really do. I really do. I never thought I'd be doing this, even though somehow. All the signs have shown it in the past things. Hello, Empress. How you doing, baby? Welcome. Welcome. Everyday spells. Glad you're here, baby. Happy St. Patty's Day and to my Pisces. Happy birthday. Whoever's born today is really lucky. I know that much. All right. So we got everything. We need the angel card. And we need... We got what we got for our um tonight, Empress Tara. I'm not reading questions, that won't be till tomorrow, baby. I'm just doing all signs special today, getting them all trying to get them all done. We didn't make it, but we're close. <laughs> it's all right, we started today. All right, what do we got? Somebody's gonna have a nice bank account. Somebody's got a confession. All righty, we got best of you, Foo Fighters. All right, greatest hits. Yes, y'all are great. All right, what do we got for your angel? Re Nove, 26, exhaustion, yeah. So try not to overexert yourself, guys. We'll get into that deeper in a little bit. We got the best of you. Okay. All right, what do we got for Aquarius? What do we got for Aquarius? I hope you like it here, Empress. All right. Hope you become a dreamer, baby. Here, over here, it's all about abundance and overall love, yes. 5501 109. All right, good numbers. 5501 one nine one zero nine write it down babies check out your numbers see what the message is all righty what do we got all right we got luck ho oh, ho that well you know i was trying let me see if i could find this one for you guys <laughs> i'm gonna show you y'all got the lucky card tonight yes all right let me see if i can find it in here y'all are gonna love it i was hoping that i would do it See, you got two luck cards, see? In there. All right. Where is it at? We had the first one was catnip. We got tea tree, patchouli, thyme, lemon, seaweed, eucalyptus. Where is it at? Where is it at? Where is that? Y'all going to love this one. I was hoping it would come out. There it is. Aha, there it is. I was hoping it was going to come out. Maybe it will. Still, we got one more to go. Yes. All right. So, do we got them all? Do we got them all? Do, 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 Uh, yeah. We got them all. Yeah. All right. Let's get started. So, we got the luck. There's the lim lime citrus. Yes. All right, welcome aboard. 31 is your number. Welcome aboard. Aquarius, get your seat. Get your pen and paper. All righty. All righty, what do we got? It's the best of you, baby. Is somebody getting the best of you? Okay. 
Somebody is, is wishing they were still in your life. All right. Nobody's a fool, you, he said. He's tired of starting again, baby. It's okay. It's, it's about how many times you get up, not how many times you're knocked down. Okay, tw uh, 31. Luck, lime, citrus, orantifolia. Many things grow in the garden that were never sown there. Thomas Fuller. Oracle meetings. You may find you are right in the middle of a situation at present or that something is stuck in circles. So you're going through cycles, repetitive cycles. And this could be caused by overreactions or too much interference. It's time to let things progress at their own pace. We were just talking about that with you guys feeling out of alignment. Limes bring luck with them, so take a chance and be ready for the ups and downs this energy brings. But know that time is on your side. Don't overplan and be open to letting complexities unravel on their own. Go with the flow. Cultivation. Lime trees need heat, humidity, and sun, so do not do well in cool to cold climates. Plant from mid-spring to early summer and tropical zones. Early spring to early summer in temperature areas. And if you are up for the challenge, cooler environments, ensure they are planted in a nitrogen-rich soil that is prepared with well-rotted manure compost harvest when the fruit begins falling from the tree. I got a lemon, a Meyer lemon tree growing. I had a lot of stuff, grapes, all kind of stuff growing up there in the mountains. So I've lost some because, you know, things going on, but I will get it going again. I'm ready. All right, we got, oh, I love this one. Holy sleeps when it's raining. 3 a.m., Matchbox 20. It's 3 a.m. somewhere, or you guys are waking up at 3 a.m. Your angels are waking you up. All right. Magical correspondence uses awareness, harmony, inspiration, anxiety, and protection. There you go, guys. Use some lime in your food. I like lemon or lime chicken. Very good. With rice deities, Dewey Sri, Hainuelu, as you know, celestial, the sun, astrological sign, Capricorn, maybe you got Capricorn in your chart. Yes, it's going with the flow, I see. Luck spell. If you have had bad luck, get rid of it with this burial spell. Insert needles all over a fresh line while you speak aloud. The bad luck moments you have had. Cover the lime by winding black r ribbon around it and say, and now you are bound. Bad luck of mine be gone forever with this lime very deeply somewhere away from your home all right i must be lonely it's maybe sometimes and the rain will wash away i believe it all right so we got blackberry Twenty-four is a good number. Right. It's made up of all fused to. Alright. Time to break free boundaries in place. Intruder stalker, get out of my face. Oh, oh, oh you got a stalker. Thorny sharp branches and berries of black protect me from invasion to prevent attack. This magic is worked with harm to none, so mote it be. There it is done. Yeah, say that to them. Yeah. Hope it's raining on the stalkers. <laughs> Blackberry's guidance. Somebody is desperate to be part of your life and could be pushing your buttons right now. Yeah, well, they know that you're fixing to be star because that's what you are. Yes. Their invasive presence and blatant disrespect of your boundaries is making you feel uncomfortable. Neighbor disputes could be an issue for you as boundary lines are crossed, or you may be fighting for personal space at work. Time to break away and free yourself from the 
entrapment and attachments of others and heal from anything that is causing you unease. If you permit, I shall protect you from unwanted invasion with my thorny branches. Plant me in your garden to prevent energy vampires from crossing your threshold. And if my thorns draw the per perpetrator's blood as dark and juicy as my berries, then you can be sure that justice is served. You always put them in front of your windows, that's for sure. Recommended recipe. Jam for use in cakes, preserves, jellies. Place blackberries and lemon juice in a large pan and simmer until fruit is soft. Warm sugar in the oven. Then add fruit and stir over low heat until sugar dissolves. Now bring to a boil for 15 minutes. Once setting point is reached, remove pan from heat. Take the scum off and leave for 15 minutes. Put the jam into jars and seal right away. Once cold, label and date. Blackberry revealed. The ancient Greeks used the blackberry to treat gout and also made blackberry tea to soothe sore throats and cure colds. Blackberries were also used for healing wounds and preventing scurvy. That's awesome to know. The Native Americans used blackberry roots and leaves to heal digestive and intestinal illness. They also used the juice as a dye and ink. Wow. All right, we got pain. Yeah, three days. So somebody may be going through some pain for three days. This may help you. There you can use turmeric and stuff. I did a recipe for dessert, kind of like a strawberry shortcake, but it was done with different kinds of fruit. And I made two 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 six two two one oh five. I um I made it where the the layers you could you, it was the way I made the sauce for the drizzle, the sweet sauce. I had blackberries, blueberries, stuff like that, oranges, pineapple, a little bit of coconut. But it was it you could taste different flavors, but not a, right away. One was orange, one was almond, and one was a blackberry was cool all right so we got truth so be true to thyself aquarius you are the truth you are our leaders right now okay yes okay so we got every day trust me i got a plan every day spells Ruby Tuesdays. Okay, Tuesday may be y'all's day. We had quite a few. That's Wednesday. Sagittarius, I think, was one of them. If you want to jumpstart your life and bring about positive change, tap into the power of the rose-colored and red stones. Stones of this color spectrum contain life's energy and can help you become more motivated, energetic, and vibrant. Wear this list of rosy and red stones or place them on your desk and throughout your home for an instant boost. Alexandrite, carnelian, garnet, and red coral, red jasper, rhyolite, rose jasper, and ruby. The power of these uh, rose and red crystals and gems is greatly amplified if you wear them on Tuesday. Here we go. Truth Tuesday, right? All right. Hi. Naya, what's up? Uh, Gemini is the first batch, baby. That'll be part one. All right, so we got memories. So people are making memories. You need to make memories or somebody's having memories of you. All right, so we got, oh yeah, protection. Yes, you have divine protection from angels and ancestors and guides who are fighting for you. They want you to be the star. You were chosen. Science. There is something unfolding for you. Work with an open mind. Consider careers in science or any job that unravels the mysteries of the universe. Yes. Because you're connected, babies. Apply a scientific approach to your business or financial problem. Go, queen! Yes. David Bowie also featured... Under pressure. Oh, baby, you are. Money manager. This card could indicate your career or finances could take a giant leap forward. 
<clears throat> especially if you're a star, right? And leaders consider careers in money management, banking, accounting, or anything in finance. You can expect a happy outcome when it comes to your finances. Okay, so if you're going to be a star and you got all these things going on under pressure, right? Explore. Keep trying. There are no mistakes, just opportunities to learn and grow. That's right. You may be called to explore careers that match your fearlessness and curiosity. You may need to go wandering and trust the unknown. That's where magic lies. Yes. Friends, scream, let me out. All right. We got Quaking Aspen. We are one. Yes, we are connected to you. Yes. Started in 2020. All right. We are in Aquarius age. Yes. I'm trying. And you are queen or king. Yes. All right. What? Wrong book. I'm sitting here looking at the wrong book. All right. I'm getting tired, I think. Yeah, this has been a long day. But it was a good day. Let me out. All right. Here we go. Beautiful card. We are one. Quaking Espen. Populous Tremuloids. Despite the trembling of her leaves, Aspen isn't really scared. How do I know? Because deep underground, all the Aspens hold hands. And maybe you are from Aspen, Colorado. To our eyes, Aspen trees are individuals. But in their roots and hearts, they are one. This is not mere metaphor. Aspens grow in what's called a clonal colony, sending out underground suckers to find a lovely spot to sprout. A sister tree. Aspen groves are among the largest and oldest single organisms on the planet. Wow, learn something new. When you see Aspen quivering, it's often with laughter. She giggles gently at the human race, who seem to have forgotten that deep in our roots, we too are one. Aspen asks us to root into the sense of connection so we can let go of our fears. Wow, that's awesome message. Thank you, Spirit. All righty. Change our way of caring, he says. 707. 170716. This is ours. Our last dance. This is ourselves. Under pressure. We are under pressure, guys, to change it. Let's do it. All right, Angel Renove. But it's not a pressure we can't handle because we know how to do it, right? All right. Where'd it go? Oh, 26. I went too far. All right. Element Fire, Planet Mars, Message. Beware of venting your rage on innocent bystanders in the face of defeat and frustration. Because you are a leader. Renault's totem beast is a gargoyle. He represents the shadow side of our character, which emerges when even the most even-tempered and cheerful of us feel beset by enemies and unfair treatment. So if you got that stalker that's trying to push you, don't let him. You know what the game is. <clears throat> that's how you beat him. Then we are likely to inflict our frustrations on innocent friends and family as if they were to blame, driving them away at the time when they could help us through our difficulties. Yes, don't always have to be so strong. It's okay to accept some love. Everyone suffers defeat and injustice at times. Misplaced rage only makes the situation worse. Card motto, exhaustion. Yeah, and that happens, tends to really happen when we are tired. Yes. All right. Thank you so much, Aquarius. I enjoyed you being here. Thanks for liking and sharing. It does help the algorithm. It helps our channel grow. And we definitely appreciate you. And I love you as much. And uh, thank you for sharing your journey with me. And I with you. All right. Till next time.
smooches. Don't forget, see the light, be the light, and show the light. Alrighty. Alrighty, so we are going to Pisces. Happy birthday, babies. And happy St. Petty's Day. All right, last resort. Ha, 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 Papa Ran uh, Roach. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> We're leaving with that one, huh? Okay, we just talked about that. All right. All righty. Did somebody care how you're bleeding, baby? Selfish individuals. Selfish individuals. All righty. So somebody's contemplating unaliving themselves. Not a good idea, guys, because you're definitely going to come back. <laughs> you got to you got to do it. All right, what do we got? Pisces. 